Yeah, it's coming together. Um, what I'm attempting to do, I used to have a fire pit right here, and it basically I burned and burned and burned, trashed my tree, trying to turn it off. I hope it it'll probably come back, but like I said, I burnt all the leaves and stuff, and I burnt all kinds of stuff right here by my house. But anyway, um, long story short, the soil is hard as a rock. So what I'm attempting to do, well, I'm not going to tip it, I'm going to get it done, is uh, I, instead of taking a plow, which takes forever, and it never really it takes a long time to get it right, and then you got to worry about the soil, the seed taken to the soil. But what's going to happen here, I've already pretty much, this part didn't get affected that bad, but I got to do some work up here too. But basically where I'm starting at, I'm kind of cutting the line with the pressure washer, and basically I'm going to cover all this area, and I'm basically going to put shade, shade seed, Slash sunlight seed in, in the in, in the uh, right here, but it's pretty much just half because you know it doesn't really grow that well because I need its uh, shade shade grass, and I'm not really planting at the ideal time, but I don't want to keep looking at this the whole summer, so I'm gonna go ahead uh, go ahead and plant it now. I, I could wait till the fall and have it all ball right here for the longest and stuff, and it's just a, it's really a big eyesore because everybody comes who comes to the you know for pool events sees this big ball spot in my, in, my, in my thing. So basically, this is gonna be a, it's not even a quick fix, it's a quick solution to what I need. So I'm gonna, I got my shade tree. I'm not, I'm not gonna get close because I'm not, they don't, they don't promote me, so I'm not gonna tell you who I, who I use. But anyway, but it should use for all, as long as it's shade, shade seed. So I'm gonna go ahead and basically cut, carve in this area what I'm doing like this, right? And I'm gonna turn it all into this mud. Let me, let me, uh, as you can see, I've already done that part, but I'm gonna work my way back to it because I'm getting muddy. So anyway, I'm gonna pr pretty much tear all the soil up. I mean, pretty deep too. It's gonna be this this pressure washer, which is a pretty you know great pressure washer, 4200 psi. It'll tear up anything. You know, difference of using a, like I said, you, difference of using a plow is a plow. You get out here, you you know, you tear the soil up, but you can only do it so much. But with this, I tear the soil up. And it makes it mushy. So when I put the seed down, it's just gonna. And then I'm gonna after I put the seed on top, I'm just gonna step all over it, shove it down the mud. And I'm telling you, it's gonna be down there doing its thing. And I'm and like I said, I'm gonna check in about two weeks. I'm gonna give you an update and show you how well it did, which I know will be good. So anyway, this is how you plant grass in the middle of the summer. 